hello 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 and welcome back subscribe to this channel give this video a thumbs up and also share it with your friends the title of our video today is the road less traveled now most of us fail to live our full potential because of fear we fear what people will say we fear what will happen to us and we fear how our lives will turn out to be and because of this we shrink ourselves to our comfort zones and walk well-known patterns where we can almost predict the outcome now there's this one famous poem by robert frost and the title of the poem is the road less traveled or the road not taken so in this poem the poet says there were two roads that led into a wood on one of the roads grass had withered because a lot of people had walked down that lane and then this other road had grass and leaves because less people had traveled that road so unfortunately he could not walk the two roads so he decided to take the road less traveled and the last part of this poem says that ages to come that the poet will tell with a sigh that two roads led into the woods and he decided to take the less traveled and that made all the difference you will never know what your life would have turned out to be if you stick into your comfort zone those who conquer the world and those who make great impacts are those who dare to live boldly and differently now let's go back to the bible there's this extraordinary event that takes place in joshua chapter 3. the children of israel are about to cross river jordan and god tells joshua to tell the priests carrying the ark of the covenant to step into the water and immediately they step into the water the water coming upstream cuts off and the priests are now standing on dry ground inside the jordan river and this event happens until all the israelites have crossed the jordan river to the other side and they cross the jordan river on dry ground so the only task that the priests had was to step into the water and everything else fell into place god took control of the situation <laughs> supposing the priests had failed to step into the water would the children of israel ever reach the promised land they would never have because there was no way they could cross the jordan river sometimes all you need to do is take fear out of the way step into the water and start taking action and once you do that everything else start falling into place my question to you today is why haven't you started that business why haven't you started that youtube channel why haven't you applied for that job why haven't you approached that guy why are you living an ordinary life when there is something so extraordinary about you why i hope this video challenges you enough to take action so until next time ciao